Uh, you've heard of 23andMe, which is yes. uh, genealogy. Yes. Genealogy. Uh, my wife gave me uh, a subscription to 23andMe. And you get your saliva and you spit into a tube and then you send it off in the mail. And then they sequence your DNA and they, they match that up against 20 million other people they have in their database, right? And I did it, you know, because I got it for, for Christmas present. And I didn't expect anything out of it. And then you can, inside that application, you can, when they give you your, your DNA, you become part of the entire 20 million universe that they have. And others have even more. Uh, and you can uh, elect to share your DNA with that entire group, 20 million people. So you can push a button and slide it over, and now you're in, into, into the entire database. That's now, does this mean that they're allowed to know about you and vice versa, or what does that mean, being the database? Well, yeah, you give them a lot of details about your personal, who you are. No, but I mean, does that mean that another... Uh, 23 and me subscriber or member can now know that they're related to Stephen Pullen. Here's his uh, email and phone yeah, number. That's not, no, not email and phone number. Yeah. But they, yeah, that, that's the idea of this. When you elect and you agree that you share it, you know, there's under some requirements, you share your DNA into this database uh, and up pops all of your suspected relatives. Okay. So I have a currently about 1800 relatives, people who have my DNA. And they're all over the world. Now, at the top of the list, most DNA is one girl. Her name is Dove. Uh, and she has, I think it's 51.9% of my DNA. So she's my daughter. Oh, oh, see, I don't, I wouldn't know the percentage of <laughs> DNA that makes. Yeah, yeah. But that makes her my daughter. Uh, okay. <laughs> so pick yourself I'm up from the I floor. I want a story well told here. Yeah, pick yourself up from the floor. You go, what the? Is you kidding me? I said, I don't have a daughter, you know. Yes, you do. And I checked, I called 23 and me. And I said, what is this? Your algorithm must be wrong. Something went wrong <laughs> with this whole thing. It's, just, it's another guy. No, she's definitely your daughter. And so we began, began communicating inside a text app, just like you have on your computer here, right? Texting back and forth yeah. and, you know, asking each other questions. Hey, they say that we're, you know, father and daughter here. And uh, so how'd this happen? Do you believe it? She said, I, I don't know. You know, I, I had a dad, he died two, two years ago and my mother just died a year and a half ago. And, um, so I don't know anything about my mom's previous life. And you know, I'm 34. <laughs> so it was 34 years ago. So long story short. Was your mother at a Rolling Stones concert? All right, go ahead. Yeah, go well, ahead. so in, you gotta go back to the 80s. So where was Steve in the 80s? Steve was in Dallas, Texas. Her mom was in Dallas, Texas at the same time. And I go, well, that narrows it down a little bit. So I go, okay, well, oh my God. I, I better do some more research on this. So in my garage, I have every a diary, like... I have a diary like this that I'm holding up here. This is my diary for 2021, right? And every day I write a note in the diary about what happened, what happens to me, right? So I have every okay. diary, every diary for like 30 years or something like that. So I went in the garage one weekend and rooted around. I found 1984, 1985 diaries. And sure enough, her mother's name is in the diary. Oh, my God. And I go, well, well, okay. A good chance now. <laughs> <laughs> now we should get into this a bit, you know. So it's turned out that, you know, she, she, we had an affair and um, it went on for about three or four months. Uh, and the result is this beautiful girl named Dove and um, got two, two grandsons. So now I have two grandsons. Um, and my, my son, who's 29, he's got a sister. Uh, and it's for real. And have you met? We met. She she lived in uh, Long Beach. Uh, oh, perfect. For years, and so we, it was easy for us to hook up, uh, and we spent a lot of time together. And uh, she's got a great little family. But they just moved to Texas because they wanted to ha buy a house, buy houses for nothing over there. 
uh, and, and they moved to Texas, raising their family up north of Austin in the country. So it's been an interesting, uh, interesting uh, situation. Um, so as far as you developing formats in that area, yeah. this, is this come out of your 23andMe experience, which is amazing, yeah. by the way, yeah. like amazing. Yeah. How's your wife, by the way? How is your wife with you having a daughter? React How to is it? it? Oh, you know, we've, we've been married about 10 years. And so it's like uh, I'm a straight arrow anyway. So she can appreciate the, you know, track star from Australia, uh, <laughs> loose in those days, in the 80s, you know, kind of get away with it. I mean, it's. She doesn't really care. I mean, she um, she's fine with okay. it, and, and they've met, and they're great friends now. You know, so that's the way it is. It's like it's, it's, these things happen. People have a past. That's an amazing, amazing story. That's honestly, and I'm like sincerely for you personally, very happy for you, and Thank very you. happy yeah. for Dove, yeah. especially losing her parents that she knew. Yeah. Oh, it's been to be able to have you show up like that. Yeah, I show up, and here I am. I'm. Uh, Available dad. So um, I'm not going to tell you the name of the of the series that I've got developed, and I've made a sizzle for this already, uh, and it'll blow your socks off. I mean, it's I've got it with my Hollywood agent right now, and he's uh, he's so excited about it. They, they they're going to shop it around for me, uh, and uh, I think it's. I mean, I I get moved every time I see the sizzle. Because I did it about the, okay. about our first meeting when we first met up, and it's it'll just blow you away. And so I I, I figure I can do that a hundred times. This has been Jeff Stearns connected through cars.